if y'all ain't listening to Ella May, I feel sorry for you. <laughs> Let me just say that. Anyway, this is your girl TT. Welcome back to my channel of all things life, love, and beauty. My real name is Latanya Christina, but I am known as TT. I hope you guys are having a great week so far. And like I said, if you are not listening to Ella May, you are not listening to R&B right now because between her and her H E R. In my opinion, they've got R&B locked right now, in my opinion. Those are the two that I listen to the absolute most right now. But anyway, that's just, that's just me. But anyway, today, I'm bringing you guys a haul. You know, I or we buy so much makeup, I think we let other things fall to the wayside, meaning clothes and shoes and, you know, maybe household <laughs> goodies and, and stuff like that. So I said, you know what, it's Christmas and all the sales are great. I'm going out to buy me some shoes and some clothes and just a little bit of everything. So today I'm going to bring you guys my, I'm going to refer to it as like a fall winter haul <laughs> is really kind of what it is to me. Just some things, uh, several things that I <laughs> picked up. I'm going... I have so much makeup I don't really have any any anything else so I went out and I you know just had to treat myself to a few items so I'm going to share with you guys what I purchased in my recent fall winter haul but before we do that let's not forget to like comment and subscribe to my channel of all things life love and of course beauty and please feel free to let me know what you guys want to see, what you like or what you don't like. You know, obviously what you want to see more of. So we're going to get into this haul. It's going to be a good one, I'm going to say. Because again, I, like a lot of us, have been buying a lot of makeup. And I felt the need to go out and treat myself. So that's what I did. So if you want to see all that I have purchased in my fall winter haul, stick around. Okay, so let's just get started with this haul that I did. But let me first start off by saying, I think in one of my last videos, or maybe something I posted on Instagram, my Instagram is Latani Christina, by the way, and I purchased, or I used this melted matte metallic from Too Faced, and the color is I Want to Rock With You. And when I tell you this stuff stayed on through brunch and a couple of mimosas, water, coffee, this stuff did not budge, but I tell you, when I get ready to take it off, that might be a different story, but I tell you, this matte metallic from Too Faced, the bomb. Okay, so I just thought I'd add that in there. So let's just start off with makeup, <laughs> because of course that's always uh, a, a good starting point. So one of the first things I bought was <laughs> a cork lip pencil pencils from MAC. Someone posted on Twitter that cork was going to be discontinued. And anyone who has been wearing MAC and cork for a million years knows this is one of the best neutral nude lip pencils on the market right now. And so I immediately went out and bought whatever they had, which was three. And they're what, $18 a piece? And all they had was three. And then I did a live chat online with Mac and they said it was discontinued. So I guess at some point Mac saw my my comment on Twitter about it being discontinued and it's the rapture and they actually tweeted me back and told me that it wasn't being discontinued and that it's been out of stock for quite some time. So I guess that's why people thought it was being discontinued, but I'm going okay, the rapture's not here. You know, cork is still around. So, but now I won't be running out anytime soon. I did buy some earrings because I just love hoops and I love silver and they were on sale at Macy's so I just went for it. Okay, so let's see what else we got. You need these. These Neutrogena makeup remover wipes to me are the best makeup remover wipes on the market. I used to wear the MAC ones and they were a little... 
heavily scented for my liking until I got hip to these. And these are the, the night calming ones. I love these things. I got these from Ulta. And there's two, you know, packs in here. Pre-moisten. I think it's 25 in each, you know, package. And so they go a long way. Love those. Absolutely love those. I picked up some Ardell Wispy lashes. I mean, these things are $5.99. No, actually, I think these were... This is, they were probably about $7.99. And I have a pair of them on now. And I love these lashes. They also have the Invisa band that I like too. So I really, really like these. I mean, these are some bomb lashes right here. And if you don't want to spend a lot of money, you'll get just as many uses out of it. I would definitely recommend that. So I'm always complaining about my oily skin. And here's the reason I don't shop in Ulta a lot is because they don't give out samples. But I was talking to a girl in there who was their skincare specialist complimented me on my skin. And I was telling her I have oily skin and I really try to take care of my skin. And I have from, you know, my, my teenage days. And she recommended Exuviance. So it's, it's a primer. You know, I gave up on primers a long time ago. And supposedly you know this is dermatologist developed it's light oil free it observes excess you don't have to reapply it throughout the day I got this cleansing gel to kind of go with it it's normal in a combination it's formulated with AHA and PHA and all those you know abbreviations to exfoliate and clarify deep cleans to remove makeup and impurities soap free and is non-drying and conditioner soothe and improve texture so we'll see on that my hopes are high on that we'll see because as I said I had really given up on primers a while ago and I'm just over primers okay so then I went to Morphe and I picked up the high, the AH high sculpting kit. I think it was like 25 bucks. I mean, Morphe's prices are just really, really good. And it's a, you know, it's a highlight and contour palette. Really, really nice for, you know, for my complexion, I'm going to say. And I mean, who doesn't love a great contour? And I love the colors in here. I was watching a video of Desi Perkins a couple of days ago, and she did a sculpting video. And I really like it. So I was motivated by, by that. So I was actually thinking of trying to recreate that look that Desi did. And so I, I went and got this. She used the one from Sigma. Morphe was just close. It was, you know, right next door to Macy. So I picked this up, you know, just to kind of see what this is going to get me. No trip is complete without going to Sephora, of course. And I picked up these candles. I'd seen them a couple weeks ago. And, I mean, anything that's alcohol-related that smells good is all right with me. And these three candles <laughs> were only $20. The scents, oh, I was going to say flavors, but I guess it's a little bit of both. Spice Sangria, Lice Peritini, and Rosé Spritzer. And... Just smelling through the the box they just smell really good and I love candles just as much as the next person and especially this time of year I'm not a big fan of like gingerbread or peppermint scented candles you know you can kind of really miss me <laughs> on those I like fresh berry scents and and things like that Bed Bath & Beyond <laughs> I bought so much stuff from there. I, I don't even have time to show you what I bought from there, but I got some some of my favorites since there. One of my favorites since there is Hello Beautiful. I love this. And it's buy three, you know, get three free. So I have a couple, you know, of these. And I think I got the other scent I got. I don't recall what it was, but I love it. And, as if you didn't know, they had a sale recently on their three-way candles. And they're normally $24. Yeah, they're $24.50, actually, like, for a candle. So I picked up, of course, Black Cherry Merlot. It's alcohol-related. And they're $8.95. And this one just, it smells heavenly. I purchased one a few months ago. 
and it was not on sale. And when I saw it on sale again, I just I had to, to snap one. So I got that. So the house can smell really, really good, you know, around the holidays. So we'll get into some clothes that I purchased because again, all I've been buying is makeup and I'm going, you know, all the holidays, holiday parties coming up, I need some clothes. I had clothes, of course, but you know, you always can have more. So went to Macy's <sighs> and I wish I could try all this stuff on for you, but I usually just, I know my size, so I don't have to try stuff on a lot of times, but I got this really cute Rachel Roy top here. Nice little fitted top. It'll probably go great with some some leggings or jeggings, you know, of sorts. So there's that. And I don't really buy a lot of white, but I thought it was cute. Can't have red. Gotta have red for the holidays. So this little cute shirt here from Vince Camuto. Really, really cute with some jeans, you know, or some leggings, some booties, you know, depending on what you're wearing. I love a nice leather jacket, faux leather, you know, most of the time. And Bar 3 is a brand in Macy's. And I got this little Moto jacket here. This jacket here is so, so, so cute. This jacket was originally $100. I got it for $24. And it's kind of like a, a grayish taupe color, very neutral color the black wasn't on sale which is otherwise I would have gotten black because black is easy but in my world I stepped out of my comfort zone and I got the, the grayish taupe color so that's going to be cute and I love a good sale and so no sale would be complete without shoes hmm. I killed it in the shoe category I walked out with I think I got four pairs of shoes hmm let me show you what I got. <laughs> now, did I need all four pairs of shoes? Probably not. But I told y'all, I've been buying nothing but makeup. So I needed some clothes and shoes. I got some leggings too. And I think I wore the leggings <laughs> already because I love leggings and they're on sale right now. Express. I think they're buy one, get one half off or something like that. So leggings. And I love their leggings because they're just kind of thick. And I, I just love them. First pair of shoes. <laughs> I don't think y'all ready for this, but we we gonna, we just going to go right into this. So these beauties here are by guests and I'm sure they have a name they're called Holly hmm, okay look at these I mean this is a beauty here this is Holly whether it's the holidays or not these are just a beautiful shoe they came in suede and they came in red I have a couple of red shoes that I wear, just kind of an accent, but I get more use out of this style with the peep toe and the really high heel here. I get more use out of this than, you know, the red. So there's one pair of shoes. All right. <laughs> you know what's funny is I'm not a big shoe girl. I love clothes and I like jackets. I'm not much of a sweater person, but I love like a really, like I said, like a faux leather jacket and a couple nice ones I've gotten from Target by Mosimo. And I love those too. And, but I, I do like a nice pair of shoes. I also love a nice pump. <laughs> I mean, you always need a nice pump. And let's see what the name of these are. These are by Jessica Simpson and they're called... Uh, they don't have a name. They're just Black Rumba Snake. Mm. Nice pump. Very, very nice. You always need a nice pair of black pumps. And, you know, I was thinking, do, does it really have to be red bottoms? Not really. But these are cute. They're functional. You can wear them with jeans. You know, you can wear them with leggings, with jeggings. You know, you can dress them up, dress them down. You know, again, you, you can never really not have enough pair of pumps and then for the let's see I have all this stuff here 
another overload. All right, then there's the casual part of me. And I saw someone, I don't know where I was, and she had on these really cute tennis shoes that had a, a wedge heel on them. And I saw something similar in Macy's. And these are by Steve Madden. And he makes very comfortable shoes. And it's just called a wedgie. <laughs> it's just called a wedgie. And they're really, really, really cute. Uh, a functional, you know, again, leggings, you know, jeans, very casual, you know, very much, you know, L.A. style here. We don't get a lot of rain here, so, you know, suede, we can, we can often get away with wearing, you know, more often than not, than most climates, again, because we just don't get a lot of rain here. Lastly, hmm. I'm a huge booty fan. I love booties. I probably have more booties than shoes. And these are called Rivera. This is a suede shoe. It's a booty. And I'm going to say it's quite the lovely shoe. I like Jessica Simpson shoes. So, I mean, this right here, the bomb. I mean, nice. It's high. OMG. I see me wearing these very soon during the holidays couple parties dinners that we're going to these beauties here oh my they're going to get worn now will they be worn a lot probably not <laughs> but you know they will they will definitely you know still get still get worn so and that's it for shoes and that really is a lot of, of what I purchased myself recently and I'm really happy with my purchases <laughs> actually I didn't have you know buyers remorse or anything like that you know because most of it I actually needed and I'm happy about it my husband would be like did you really need those candles CT uh yeah I needed those candles we need those candles because I like for stuff to smell good so that's my haul you guys and I hope you guys like it. I got a little bit of everything. Didn't break the bank too much, but, you know, I like to treat myself, you know, on occasion with buying myself things outside of makeup. Because <laughs> that's all I save to buy is makeup. So I hope you guys like my haul. Let me know what you think. Please comment below, you know, hit the little bell so you know when my videos are uploaded. And don't forget to subscribe to my channel. This is my fall winter haul. I went a little ape shit. I did. I went a little. I did. I, I went a little ape shit. You know, I think, you know, this calls for a little bit of ape shit. Let's, let's just say. Yeah, let's, let's just say I went a little ape shit. <laughs>